guys welcome back to my channel so in this clip i'm just showing you how the her giving her kinky blowout hair looks in its natural state and yes i colored it and i have a tutorial on how i colored it so now i'm just going to start straining the hair and i like using the rat tail comb method it's not even what it's called or the chase method i think it's called the chase method basically you're just doing what i'm showing right now i feel like when i do it this way the hair gets super straight and flowy compared to when i just use a plain straightener and i'll link the um straightener in the description box as well as well as the hair everything will be in the description box so make sure to check there if you want to know something so yeah i'm just straining the hair and you can see it's getting pretty flat it's still kind of big but it's flat to say the least So now that I'm done straightening one side, you can see the difference between one side being straightened and one side not straightened. It's pretty thick, and now I'm going to cut it. So I was really geeked about this part. So basically, I'm just going to put a ponytail holder onto the hair, and you're going to want to like put it where you want to cut it at. So don't put it too high because your hair is going to be super short. Because as you're going to see, I'm cutting above the ponytail holder, not below. So I'm putting it where I want it to be cut, and now I'm just going to cover my scissors. You guys, please stop me in the comments. I know I'm supposed to use shears, but I couldn't find any in my house. So I'm using scissors. Not that big of a deal because it's weave anyway. But yeah, I'm just going to cut it. Once I cut that hair off, the hair instantly looks better, you guys. Like, I feel like it did a total 180. Not 360 all the way, because it's going to be a 360 at the end, you feel me? But right now, I did, like, a little 180. But, um, yeah, I kind of, like, messed it up a little bit. So, I'm just going to go back with the scissors and just, you know, line it up some more. So this is how the cut looks, and it's super duper cute, but of course, I needed to add a little bit extra. You know me, always doing the most. So now I'm just going to put some flat iron curls in it. And to me, flat iron curls are my favorite type of curls because they just look better, and you ain't got to have that many, I don't know, it's just easier, and it looks better to me than wand curls. So I'm just going to get the hair and put it in between the plates and just wrap it around and just pull it. It took me forever to learn how to do this, you guys, but it's really not as hard as it looks. Because for me, it looks super duper hard, so when I tried it, I'm like, bro, like, this is irritating like it was super hard then i just got the hang of it i'm like like this is my favorite thing to do now so if it looks hard just keep practicing because i promise you it's not that hard and it's better than wild girls finished and this is how it looks i really like the cut and the color and the curls just made it pop even more you guys let me know what you guys think down below and don't forget everything about this hair will be in the description box so thank you so much for watching see you guys soon bye